So it's 1.45 a.m. I'm here at Bush Airport in Texas and uh, just waiting on my flight at 6.15 a.m. this morning uh, flying with Interjet. So I'm gonna pick back up uh, vlogging here. I know I've been a little missing in action because I've been spending a lot of time with family and uh, I have a bunch of footage that I still need to edit. So now I'm gonna be more by myself and I'll have time to actually uh, vlog a little bit more. Um, gonna hang out here, edit some more videos, and just wait until the gates open up in the morning. Because none of the gates are open yet. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, not much going on right now. Uh, probably comment more as the night develops, see how long I can stay up. <laughs> uh, hopefully they open, I think they open at 5 a.m. I just asked some guy and he didn't really speak any English. I, asked him in Spanish and he's like yeah yeah that's uh, a la cinco I was like okay it's five <laughs> anyways uh, it's been cool seeing the family and I'm glad I had more time with them be able to see them before I head off to Mexico here and I'm excited for what comes ahead because it should be an awesome adventure coming down there and uh, catch you guys in a little bit just gonna uh, get some work done I guess just chill out so, yeah I just got here to Mexico City, waiting for my flight. It's about four more hours until the plane arrives, so I'll probably just go find some uh, uh, ATMs, withdraw some uh, Mexican pesos, and buy some water, and maybe some lunch here in a bit. So let's go a little, do a little bit of exploring. I'm here at Benito Juarez Airport in uh, Mexico City. I've just been hanging around here and trying to get some money from the ATM, but the maximum amount the machine gave was uh, $50, which is a thousand Mexican pesos. And I'm trying to find a way to withdraw more. I think you can withdraw up to 3,000 pesos, which is like 150 bucks. Because I'm going to use it to pay for my hostel, so I'd like to get it uh, all at once so you, I don't have as much transaction fees. So I'm going to keep looking here and maybe try the next airport when I land in Guadalajara. And now, uh, just been working on some of the video editing uh, when I was going to the beach in Texas and things like that. And uh, my flight's about to leave pretty soon, so I'm about to hop on. And it's pretty cool here at the airport. It was about 60 degrees Fahrenheit when I got here this morning. It's not too hot yet, but it just could just be the day. But, uh, it would be a cool city to check out in the future. Um, but for now, let's just head to Guadalajara. connected to the uh, data and it's pretty quick to use. Uh, it was better here than in uh, Mexico City. Um, so I'm just going to use Uber pool, get back to the hostel. This is the hostel I'm staying at. It's Hospitarte Centro. It has these little balconies, which is really cool. It's a really cool view. I'll show you guys here. Basically, it's like a little balcony and you can get fresh air and you just go outside and let people watch. Yeah, it's, it's a really nice city. Weather is beautiful today. Uh, it's definitely not as hot as uh, Houston. So I'm enjoying it a lot here. And the ride here, I took an Uber pool, which was only 118 pesos. So that works out to be uh, $6. Yeah, $6. And I think I'm just going to take a break here, maybe meet some friends and try to find some food later. But yeah, awesome hostel so far. And uh, let's see what turns out.
right? YouTube. You can be YouTube superstar. <laughs> you put on the uh, uh, Instagram? Taco shop. We got four tacos and I got a Fanta and I got some other tacos. You want to say hi? You want to be YouTube famous or not? I didn't point it to you yet. <laughs> All right. This is Annie. I met her at the hostel and she's from Vietnam. Hi. Vietnam. Okay, cool. <laughs> you want to say anything else? <laughs> no. It's hard. It's hard for people in this spot too. Um, I got two um, carne asada tacos. One pastilla and one ferrito. I never tried the last two, but let's see how it goes. <laughs> This is some spices. I think this will be good. Though. So those tacos were pretty good, and it was only two dollars and fifty cents for all four of them. They were tiny, but they had a lot of flavor in them, uh, probably because they don't use uh, growth hormones or anything like that here. And it came with a lot. It came with a lot of different side toppings too, and so you can make it more spicy if you want. And uh, I had a fanta with it too, so. Worked out pretty well, I'm full, and planning to go to an event tonight, so I'm gonna take a short break here before I head out, because it might get kinda loud. <laughs> On the way back, we stopped by a square and just checked out uh, people just playing music and guys uh, dressed up as clowns and everybody just being free-spirited, you know? But uh, now I'm back here at the hostel. This is uh, the room, by the way. There's only four beds, and then there's actually no one here. Uh, just me. So I get the whole place to myself. The one thing I love is that they do have huge lockers. I was able to put both my backpacks in without any problem at all. Uh -huh. 